As 2016 came to a close, we asked you, our supporters, to help us end the year financially strong, and you did just that. I am pleased to tell you that not only did we meet our $112,000 match that we told you about, but we exceeded it, raising over $225,000 from nearly 300 donors. From all of us on staff and on our board of directors, I wanna thank each of you who gave so sacrificially. Your gifts have helped us get closer to our budget and start 2017 in a much better financial position than otherwise would have been possible. More importantly, it means that the Family Foundation will continue to be your sh voice for our shared values in Virginia. From allowing us to hire a team of lobbyists for the soon to begin General Assembly session to a grassroots team that is active in school board battles around Virginia to our potential lawsuit against Governor McAuliffe for his administration's law-breaking action to gut abortion center health and safety standards. Your sacrificial giving makes it possible to bring about our dream of a commonwealth of strong families guided by faith and protected by a principled government, we need each and every one of you and your family and friends who aren't yet connected with us to continue to be the heart and soul of our work. We need continued activism. For many, the year 2016 counts as one they couldn't wait to end. Nationally, we endured a painful, divisive presidential campaign. While here in Virginia, we continued to watch Governor Terry McAuliffe push his so-called progressive agenda on our Commonwealth. It certainly was a year we won't soon forget. 2017 promises to be yet another challenging year with statewide elections on the horizon for November. Virginians will choose whether to continue the pro-abortion, anti-religious liberty policies of Terry McAuliffe or hire a new chief executive who hopefully will cherish our values as much as we do and fight for them over the next four years. Frankly, the opportunities are great. If the new presidential administration and Congress do as they have said and return many issues to the states, we need to be ready. We need a governor, lieutenant governor, attorney general, and general assembly who are ready to tackle tough issues. And we at the Family Foundation will need to be ready to advocate for the values you and I share so we can make real progress. Are you ready? I hope so. After the past few years of frustration with Washington, I sense a new optimism among many of you. We are all anxiously awaiting a new Supreme Court that doesn't create law and ignore the Constitution. We at the Family Foundation promise to continue to fight for you and your family, and I look forward to many victories in the coming months and years. Once again, thank you for your support. Happy New Year, and may God bless you and your family in 2017.